Hello and welcome to another session on factorization. So in this session we are going to learn how to factorize expressions of the form a plus b plus c times bc plus ca plus ab and minus abc. So this is the given expression and we are to factorize this. So how to go about it? So what we'll, we'll do is we will be first clubbing the b plus c together. Okay. So here in the second bracket, if you find out b plus c common from this one, right? So take a common from the last two here. You can take a common from here. So this, this becomes bc plus a times b plus c, correct? Minus abc. Next, what we can do is, we can now open the brackets accordingly. So hence, if you see this is A, B, C. So this goes to this, right? Then A square B plus C. Then B, C times B plus C. Then A times B plus C whole square. And then minus A, B, C. This is the expansion, right? So minus A, B, C and plus A, B, C will get struck off so hence now if you see b plus c is common to all so b plus c is taken common and you get a square plus bc plus b plus c sorry plus a times a b b plus c right okay so fair enough now you can again take something common from here why because this is a square plus a b plus b c plus a c Okay, so I've just clubbed them in such a way that I can extract some common terms. So now this is a common a plus b and here c common a plus b. Correct? So hence a plus b can be taken as common so one, one, once again. So b plus c a plus b times a plus c. Right? Or rearranging you can see you can say a plus b plus b plus c times c plus a is nothing but the given expression right so this expression is reduced to this form right so whenever a plus b plus c uh, into b c plus c a plus a b minus a b c is given then you can factorize it like that okay now two corollaries can also be discussed here so if you see we have now established this a plus b plus c times b c plus c a plus a b minus a b c is equal to a plus b b plus c c plus a correct now this can be rewritten as how can i write this as i can write this as a plus b plus c times b c plus c a plus a b minus a plus b b plus c c plus a is equal to a b c this is let's say corollary number one isn't it guys so this is corollary number one and the other way we can write corollary number two can be written as a plus b plus c times b c plus c a plus a b is equal to a plus b b plus c c plus a plus a b c correct these are the two corollaries related to this particular expression okay so now you know how to factorize these kind of expressions